Hi, this is Bruce Bixler. Welcome to my LinkedIn tips and tricks. Today's tip is how to do LinkedIn's advanced search with Boolean logic or Boolean operators. I went to LinkedIn's uh, search page and these are the results. One of them is that you can do a basic search where you can search for people, companies, or jobs. You can do an advanced search which is for people, jobs, and answers, and then you can use Boolean searches. Now, LinkedIn doesn't support wildcard searches, but you can advert, use advanced search operators and Boolean logic. Uh, they list five different types of searches you can use for the Boolean uh, results. The first one is quoted searches. The second one is not searches. The third one is or searches fourth one is and searches and the fifth one is parenthetical searches I'm going to do one example of each of these uh, just to show you how it's done so I'm going to go back to uh, advanced search on LinkedIn and we'll start out with the very basic advanced search which will be quoted searches now there is a difference if you don't use the um, quotes. I'm going to do a search with product manager and I'm going to use the local zip code and see what kind of search we come up with for product manager. The results are 85,000 different profiles uh, of people that have the word terms product or manager in their profile. Now, if you use the quotes on either side of product manager, it will look for that specific term, and we can do a search for that. So instead of 85,000 results, it will narrow it down to 25,000 results. So that is a the difference between quoted and non-quoted Boolean searches. The next one is for not searches or negative searches so I want to do one for either uh, sales manager and then put the word not computers in front of it and see what results we get again I'm going to use the local zip code and search for sales managers within 50 miles which results in 141,000 profiles now, I'm gonna do it again with the quotes but I'm also gonna show a different terminology rather than using the word not I'm going to use the minus sign and put the quotes in on either side of that so this should substantially reduce the results for sales managers but not in computer yeah, down to 39,000 and then you can refine it after that you can do it by company by your connections and by industry alright the next advanced and boolean search is the OR search. So I want to use sales manager or marketing manager. And search for them locally here and actually that resulted in 83,000 results but I have to make one correction here I have to use the capital OR it may make a difference it may yield the same amount of results 161,000 quite a bit of difference so again I'm going to put the quotes in so that it will look for these specific terms and see what the results are 
instead of 161,000, it will now be 59,000. And then again, you can refine your search by company, by your connection, and by industry after that. The next advanced or Boolean search will be the AND search. Let's do it for title over here. And I'll just use their example, manager and director. Capitalize the word and and search for that. Normally, you don't have to put the word and in there. It assumes that you're, if you have two words connected, it will be the and in between. So that results 56,000. Again, you have to refine those results by company, by LinkedIn connection, and by industry. And the final advanced search will be the parenthetical search. which will be VP or Director and Division. Anyone with the title VP and Director or Director and Division in their profile will show up. And we'll search for them. And that results 117,000 profiles with that. So I'm going to do a separate search. Now, in some instances, is if you just put, if I can spell. officer, chief financial officer, but a chief financial officer is also known as CFO. Put the quote marks in front of and around chief financial officer so it looks for that specific word. Local zip code. Let's see if any of my connections ever worked at a company called Ernst & Young. And I'm leaving it as current and past. And 226 results. With three of my first connections, former employees of Ernst & Young. I'm going to go back one step. And Ernst & Young is also known as ENY but I don't want anyone that has the word controller in their title and we'll see if that result ch changes still 226 results uh, Gordon Donovan is the first connection Rick Winters is the first connection Frank Leonard so I can contact them to find out anything I want to know about um, Ernst & Young and the CFO position at that company. So I'm going to leave you with my contact information. Uh, you can reach me through email or LinkedIn or on my website. And thank you for watching.